What's your biggest insecurity, Nick? I don't know. What is my... Don't act like Superman. No, I, I'm, sh- I have fucking insecurities. I'm just trying to think of what the fuck my biggest insecurity... What the fuck would I tell you? I don't know, because we're friends. Yeah. Let me tell you, and whoever else the fuck is watching this. What's your biggest so what? insecurity? Probably like your dick size. <laughs> yeah, like your head. The head of your fucking head. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, I got a pretty good dick size. I could say so. Yeah, yeah, sure. Um, Your head, though? Like, your... No, I was just joking. I'd probably say, um... Right now, your belly. It's probably it, it'll probably be my stomach. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I feel like, especially because like when you guys came over and like I got filmed by Dro, <laughs> and I saw the footage, I was like, damn, my stomach is really <laughs> popping out. I need to do something about that. You're still not gonna do shit. You've been saying that for a while. I know, but I just thought like I need to do something about it. Well, hey, man. Watch I surprise the fuck out of you and just, like, really get into fitness and not really talk about it. Just, like, really fucking grind. And next time you see me, I got a fucking six-pack and I can whoop your ass. Hey, man, I hope that happens. But knowing you, that's definitely not going to happen. You're just saying that to motivate me, aren't you? Yeah, sure. So tell me, what's your biggest insecurity? Uh... I don't. Is it your eyes? No, I'm. I have no issues with my eyes. Why do you think I have issues with my eyes? Because I have big eyes. I fucking love my yeah, eyes. They're big. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh. It's a. It's a. Wait, your toes. Not that either. I. Yeah, you got some pretty ugly toes, and you're not insecure about it. I don't give a fuck. Like it. It's my body. <laughs> Why the fuck should I? care i get when i was like younger i cared about like my like i was chubbier i cared about that and you didn't give a fuck you'd always pick on me so eat a dick now that you're fat you got a fucking gut hanging out i'm not fat oh yeah okay yeah sure i'm not overweight yeah no you're not i'm just the right weight i just have a stomach popping out yeah that's what your girlfriend keeps telling you i'm glad that is what she told me (laughs) <laughs> Maybe it's your mouth. No, I, it's your an, biggest insecurity. I wouldn't say it's anything about my body. I'm completely right, comfortable what is it with my about body. Your personality, then. Um, I wouldn't say it's necessarily about my personality. I guess my biggest insecurity is like, hmm, being successful. Yeah, cold heart. No, it's being successful. What a lame ass fucking that's answer. what the fuck it is though like you just made your sound you just made yourself sound perfect i'm not perfect when did i say that well you just made it seem no like no you don't have any insecurities and your only insecurity is that you're not successful no you said what's my biggest insecurity it's not like i don't have any insecurities like do i wish i was had a fucking jacked six pack yeah fuck yeah I, I wish i had that but it's not like an insecurity like i'm cool i'll go to the fucking beach I'll fucking be naked in front of anybody. I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't care. I'm sec- I'm secure about that shit. But, like, it's not like I think I'm perfect. Like, that's why I constantly go to the gym. I constantly work out and do all these things because I'm always trying to be the best version of myself. But I think my biggest insecurity is being successful in my field. The reason being is because I feel like I'm always harsh on myself. I never put out a piece of content that I'm like, this is fucking dope. I always put something out. Like today I put out a video and I fucking hate it. And I'm like, I this video is dumb as fuck. I just put it out <laughs> because it's like getting that nut out. Like you can't be the judge of it. You got to let whoever else fucking watch that shit be the judge of it. And in my mind, I completely thought this video fucking sucks. And it's performing better than the last like three videos that I posted, which makes no sense to me. But whatever. So you're insecure about your judgment. Not my judgment. Your judgment is off. 
I mean, sure, but everybody's fucking judgment is kind of off. Like, you don't know what's going to hit or not. I'm not insecure about my judgment. Like, I still think I have good judgment. Like, I know what looks clean to me and I know what I think will be a good video or not or a good idea. I'm just Mm. insecure about being successful. Insecure that I've been doing this shit for so many fucking years just like you, and I'm not at the level of success that I thought I would be at by now. And granted, that's that's me from the inside looking out, because there's people from the outside looking in that they're like, damn, I wish I was at where you're at right now, you know? But true. that's just how I feel about my own shit. Yeah, I guess I could say the same thing, but I don't find it as an insecurity. I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know either. I guess it's not like, it's not necessarily like an insecurity. It's not like I'm like depressed about the shit. Hmm. So you're insecure about like what? Never reaching the results that you want? Like getting the views that you want? Getting the, the money that comes with? recognition um i'd see i wouldn't even say that either because i think i will i'm very confident in myself that i will get to those points but i also like i'm just trying to pinpoint exactly of which part of that is right your insecurity i yeah it's, i don't know bro i don't know I, it, even like what you said i don't even know if it is like insecurity exactly you know i guess it's like lack of patience or whatever the case may be. Because I know I will be successful in my field. And again, from the outside looking in, a lot of people could say, yo, you're already fucking successful in your field. Look at what you've done. Look at the the amount of views that you've got over the years. Look at the people that you work with. Look at the circles that you're in. So, I don't know. I honestly don't know how to answer that question. I guess the easiest answer would be something about my body, but I'm pretty confident in my own body. You know, your boy got that stroke game on deck, so that's what really matters. I mean, you should consider yourself lucky then because a lot of people are, are insecure about their bodies. Look at how many women, you know, do surgeries just to improve some type of thing in their body. Right. No, I, and I get it. Or men who... But, I mean, it's like I said, it's like I'm not necessarily like I'm secure in my body, but I'm also working to better my body you know like i don't think my body's like at where it should be i think it could be way better Mm. and i could get more insecure like in the past two weeks i got a little bit more insecure about my body because of um just fucking traveling and not working out and eating wrong and then i gain a little bit of weight but then i get back to la and i put myself back into the mentality of eating well Working out all the time, fucking making sure that I lose weight and gaining muscle. So, uh, uh, yeah. Oh wow! Damn. So you, so you, you gain weight just from like a couple of days out. It wasn't just a couple of days. Like I, I've been eating bad since my birthday. Okay. Yeah, it's been damn. So the beginning of October. Yeah, yeah. It was like a solid like two and a half weeks that I was just eating bad. I wasn't going to the gym as often. I was drinking a decent yeah. amount of alcohol, which I don't really do. 